hello Gemini thank you for clicking on this reading if this resonates with you please comment down below let me know um, because this is the first time I'm doing separate zodiac readings also I'm having an Easter sale if you would like to get 25 minute reading for 16 pounds then please go for that if not then let's just get started with your reading I also have to, uh, th I have three options of readings by the way so and the 25 minute reading reading is option two and that's what's half price everything else is normal price but if you'd like to let me know uh, with an email or a message in my DMs on Instagram. So let's see what you guys have for your overall energy. I'm going to do your overall energy, love and career. So let's see what you guys have for your overall energy. What's the overall energy for Gemini, please? Are you guys having a fight with somebody? I feel like you guys are having a fight with someone. I'm not sure who it is, but... And then like a sibling, sister, uh, I don't know, something like that. Uh, okay, so we've got magic of nature, new opportunities, and honouring your true feelings. Right, let's see what else we've got. I'm going to pick from the animal spirit deck. Oh, we got two cards today. Life is a mystery. Be fearless and bold. Right, I'm going to pull out one of these. What's the overall energy for Gemini for the next two weeks, please? Three of Pentacles. I feel like we need another one. And the Two of Wands. Right, I'm going to read from the Animal yeah, Spirit Animal Oracle for the Bobcat because I'm not entirely sure if we need another message for this. The Bobcat Spirit helps you know intimately the pulse of the divine in the world trust in the wisdom and revelations that come to you yet know that understanding may not come as you would like to what you experience through your heart and intuition which comes to you as the voice of your inner knowing will guide you now as you accept the secrecy is woven into the fabric of existence bobcat spirit tells you this is not a time to reveal your deepest most cherished dreams and desires to others but rather a time to be quiet and gentle with yourself as truth begins to emerge in your awareness Self-protection is called for, so be discerning, selective and even secretive, revealing no more, that no more than necessary. People have a way of imposing their opinions on you, so pay attention to whom you surround yourself with at this time. Right, that's exactly how I felt when I said that you were arguing with somebody. That's literally, that's literally what, I felt, what I felt about... Okay, so this is the kind of situation that I feel like you're having with somebody. Um, I feel like you need to be fearless and bold in this like situation. I'm getting this like triangle and I feel like this is to do with the three of pentacles as well as like a triangle of some people. Are you in like a love triangle with somebody? Um, do you love somebody but they love somebody? That sort of situation or is it maybe you're with a friend or it could be neither. It's just the messages that I'm getting. So when you've got honouring your true feelings, I feel like you guys are looking outwards for a sort of opportunity or sort of... I feel like you guys are looking outwards for guidance and they're telling me that it will come to you in divine timing and it will come to you when you least expect it. So if you're waiting on a certain opportunity, a certain offer, um, anything like that, it's all going to come for you because you have the two options here. And I feel like a lot of you may be travelling as well. And that's all. it's all here in the cards for you, literally. Um, and the world card, uh, the world in this card, sorry, represents, I feel like, um, the community you have. So I definitely feel like you guys are sort of gathering like your friendship sort of thing and with the magic of nature I feel like maybe you need to go out in nature a bit more um maybe you could go camping I don't know why I'm getting camping but camping I feel like someone's going to give you flowers as well which is random but yeah so let's see what else we have we have honoring your true feelings as well so I definitely feel like this is to do with being fearless and bold it's basically saying it's basically showing me that you guys need to honor the feelings that are coming up and be true to who you are and be true to these feelings that are coming up this could also be to do with a water sign as well in your energy you could also have water in your chart like kind of maybe like your moon sign or something but it's also revealing to me that you need to let these feelings flow and crying is okay uh, i'm getting like someone crying so i feel like crying is gonna be is natural for you and it's also good to be angry as well but obviously be angry in your own like little space because Make sure you're not um, pointing your anger at people. I'm feeling like someone, I'm getting someone like throwing darts and they're like 
aiming them at people and people are like trying to avoid them like oh pew 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 kind of thing like do you know like the matrix where they have like is that the matrix i don't know some sort of like slow motion where they're like, avoiding the bullets is that is that the matrix i've actually never watched the matrix but that's the image that i got <laughs> i've seen that clip before somewhere um yeah it's like someone's like avoiding like the the um kind of spiteful toxic kind of conversation that's going on i'm getting like a toxic spiteful like spitting kind of energy i don't know what that's about but yeah so but there is a new opportunity coming for you and it's all going to be fine so this new opportunity will come to you and i think this is to do with a new opportunity as well so it's like you're looking out at new opportunities or someone is delivering you an opportunity you're kind of just looking out at the options so let's see what you guys have in love for the next couple of weeks Let's see, what can my Geminis expect for love in the next couple of weeks? We have attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. And what else do we have? Romantic feelings. And let your friends help you. There's definitely friends here. Is there definitely like a triangle, like a love triangle or something between you and your friend or something? I feel like you fancy your friend's ex or you fancy your friend's boyfriend. <laughs> I don't think it's that intense, but it's some sort of like... Maybe you and your friend like the same person. <laughs> yeah, it's like a love triangle keeps coming up. Whoa, okay, this is this flying out. We've got the Emperor. Didn't we just have the Emperor? I don't know. Was that for another reading? We've got the Nine of Pentacles as well. So I feel like you guys are just enjoying single life. Um, you're also enjoying somebody's company if you're with them. I feel like for your love life, I don't see someone coming in in the next couple of weeks, I'm sorry to say. But you could actually meet... I feel like I don't see someone in the cards, but you could meet somebody because we've got romantic feelings. You could also know somebody that you have romantic feelings for. And I feel like you need to, you're asking your friends for like advice on this person. I feel like I want just an overall card for what's the, what can Geminis expect in love, please? I feel like you guys are really standing in your power. Your fear, you've got this very like self-confident energy about you at the moment. So you've also got the Eight of Wands. So basically what's going to go on for you is there's going to be a message coming through, maybe from an Aries, um, like a fire sign, maybe. And there's going to be, I feel like, here's like the message coming through. I feel like you're also maybe sending a message, that sort of thing. Um, and there's attraction here. And yeah, and also I feel like you're definitely enjoying your single life or you're definitely just enjoying kind of the rewards that you're reaping up. Um, there's going to be some sort of discussion I feel like between you and like a group of friends or you and a couple of people about your love life maybe. Um, you could also be discussing kind of like I feel like you're now you're discussing in your head kind of where you want to go in this situation. But yeah I'm not really too sure I can't really see a certain person. I can see someone kind of in the distance but not actually here yet. So I feel like you could actually be meeting someone soon maybe next month or two or meet someone at work. Or you could be like interested in somebody that's already interested in them. But you, I feel like you have a chance to be with them. But I feel like like one of your friends is like interested in them as well. I'm not sure what that's about, but that is what I get. But it's definitely some sort of connection going on there. So that's really nice. So let's see what you guys have in your career. What can Gemini's expect in their career, please? Ooh. Queen of Pentacles. Three of Swords and the Nine of Cups. So there is emotional fulfillment to do with work. Um, you guys, I feel like, are maybe leaving a job. You could be thinking about leaving a job. You could think, I don't really want this job anymore. Why have I got this job? This job is crap. <laughs> um, but anyway, either whatever decision you feel like, I feel like you're gonna make, it's like you're happy just kind of being there anyway. Is that does that make sense? Like you're in a job. But you're not sure if you want to leave but if you do there's fulfillment if not you still will have money basically you'll have enough money so there's no like lack of money or anything oh we've got self-employment you're a born entrepreneur and your business is surrounded by magic opportunities right so i think maybe some of you could be quitting your job there's definitely the number three coming in guys so if you are surrounded by the number three then just know that that's, that's a definite sign because i feel like this has come up in your love um, I feel like this is coming in your upcoming your, your whole reading because we had the three of pentacles twice, didn't we? Or did we? I don't I can't remember, but so yeah, so that is what's kind of going on with you guys, and I feel like it's just a choice that there's kind of like a choice coming on and then oh synchronicity, what we were literally just saying about was the, th the number three. 
Oh, that's really funny. So yeah, definitely there's synchronicity going on. So if you see the number three or that sort of kind of thing, then that is kind of like a, a sign that your answers are being, that your prayers are being answered. It says your prayers and questions are being answered by synchronistic events. Notice them in order to increase their flow. So there's definitely some um, financial flow coming in. If you guys feel like are suffering in in money, make sure that you're giving yourself you're giving yourself space and time to um, think. I'm not sure what that's about. Think about options and also collaborate. I feel like getting getting opinions from other people is going to be really important for you in the next couple of weeks. Just if you're a bit stuck, um, and to just basically get advice and encouragement. I feel like you need it. So. So yeah, thank you for watching. If this resonated with you, please comment down below. Also subscribe if you would like to. If this video resonated with you, please comment down below and subscribe if you would like to. And I'm also doing a Easter sale. My 25 minute readings are half priced at £16. They're normally 33 So I'm also doing two other options as well for readings. But all the information is down below. Email me or message me on Instagram and I'll see you all very, very soon. Bye.